you a little bit about the motor. The 3.4 is a very rock solid motor in my experience. Uh, this has got 229,000 K. You can expect to get about 350,000 K uh, with uh, as long as proper maintenance. So it's got lots of K left in it. Now I'm going to show you uh, the condition of that motor right now. to begin with, uh, I'm not hearing any unusual noises uh, indicating that there's uh, excessive wear in this motor. I can, with uh, 30 years, I've got a very trained ear and I can pick up noises very quickly knowing that a motor has got uh, internal issues. In it. Number two is I want to show you the bottom of the oil filler cap and this is a good indicator of if there's any internal leaks. You'll see which is a good sign so I'm saying that this motor has got some life left in it has been well maintained now the next thing I'm going to show you is the uh, is the exhaust and so you can just get an idea of just whether this car is even worth looking at with the condition of the motor then I'm going to take you to 18 other points in the car so you can make an informed decision Okay, you can see by the uh, exhaust here that this is one clean burning motor. It is not burning oil in any way, shape, or form. So I'm going to say that this motor is worth uh, just taking a look at the car. Number two, I want to tell you the depth of the tread on your right front tire and how many kilometers you have left. Number two, I want to tell you that. Number three, I want to tell you how many kilometers you got left on your front right break number three number four I want to tell you the condition of your uh, of your right front strut number four number five with the jack under the right front wheel I want to tell you the condition of your right outer tie rod and your upper control arm on the right and this is critical because your outer control arm uh, outer tie rod is what keeps the steering if that you lose that you lose your steering if your upper control arm lets go then your wheel goes sideways and folks you don't want to be in a world of hurt so I want to tell you the status of that one number five number six I want to tell you the depth of the right front tire and how many kilometers you have left on number on the left, right left wheel. No, front left wheel. Number six. Number seven, I want to tell you the status of the of your of brakes on the right front. Number seven. Number eight, I want to tell you the status of your right or your left front strut. Number eight. Number nine, with the uh, jacket on the right front, front, the left front wheel, I want to show you the status of your right, of your left outer tie rod and your left upper control arm again. Very important. Number nine. Number ten, I want to tell you if there's any oil leaks in the motor or tranny that you need to be concerned about. Number ten. Number eleven, I want to tell you the depth of the. Uh, the depth of the tread in the left rear tire and how many kilometers you have left. Number 11. Number 12, I want to tell you the status of the left rear brakes and how many kilometers you have left. Number 13, I want to tell you the status of your left rear shock and your suspension. Number 13. Number 14, I want to tell you the depth of the tread on your right rear tire and how many kilometers you have left. Number 15, I want to tell you the status of your right rear brakes, how many kilometers you have left. Number 16, I want to tell you the status on your right rear shock and your right rear suspension, number 16. Number 17, I want to tell you if there's any check engine or trouble check engine lights and there is indeed one. So I want to tell you what that engine code is and what it's going to cost to repair it. Number 17. Number 18, I want to tell you the status of your fluids, your oil, your transmission fluids, your brake fluids, your, uh, uh, your antifreeze, and whether it's good, bad, or needs to be changed. Number 18.
And number 19, I want to show you the status of your battery. Good, bad, or fair. Number 19. So folks, what you need to do to get your information to make an informed decision about this vehicle, I've already showed you the status of the motor, so it is, it is definitely worth taking a look at. Com. Order the uh, report for $75 and it will give you the information you need to make an informed decision and not get the unpleasant surprises afterwards. Folks, hope to hear from you. And if this is not what you're looking for, then you need to check out our inventory because I am posting new vehicles that I have personally inspected every day. And you can buy the report for any one of them for $75. Thank you.